What is good everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today we are at Sugarloaf Mills Mall because we are doing the Key Master Challenge again of trying to play until we win. Now we've had some drama in the past with the Key Masters where I've kind of gotten scammed from the machines and I made the video and then I had to take the video down and all this different stuff happened. We're going to try again today to play until we win here at Sugarloaf Mills. We're starting off light with 500 bucks and seeing if we can go ahead and win with that and then we'll kind of go from there, go back to the ATM and all that stuff. So we're going to head into the mall now. Welcome back to vlog week. Seven videos, seven days, seven giveaways. So another giveaway is going to be in this video. If we win something, we're giving it away. So let's go ahead, head in the mall and see if we can win. All right guys, we made it into ATL Addictions where we have the key master that we're going to be attempting to win today. So obviously we have the crazy wall sneakers behind us, but what we're focusing on is this machine. So come over here. Here are kind of the stuff that we have in there. It's $5 per play. We got some Travis Lowe's. We got the Pollens, Jordan 4 Lightnings. We got Yeezy 350s, bunch of other stuff. Now we have to be kind of strategic. So I'm trying to get this done in 500 bucks. So I feel like for me going for shoes that are gonna be worth over that, it's not really worth it because I'm trying to like keep it good. So to me like, P rods probably wouldn't be the best to go for and the Travis Lowe's, but I think anything else will probably be pretty solid. I kind of like these right here, the Jordan 1 highs and the pink and the yellow. That's kind of my thoughts, but um, so we were gonna ask Andre what he thinks is kind of somewhat close, but I think that wouldn't be fair because if other people came in, they can't really ask that because why would he give away the, the sauce like that? So we're just gonna go for it and try to go for a shoe, but we're gonna continue with the thought of the shoes that are worth over 500, not to go for those because we're trying to stick under 500. Nick, what are you thinking that we should go for? I mean, looking at all the shoes, I know we're only going to be trying with 500 bucks, so there's only like a few shoes in here that are under that. I'd say there's probably a good amount. Those are like mean, two, those are like 250. That's a good one. That we looks can't, close to my we side. cannot go for the P-Rod or the Travis, I know that. But that, that Jordan 1's nice. I know that Jordan yeah. 1 is nice quality, so we could definitely do that one. Yeah, so I kind of like that one too. I think that those are worth like 250, 260, so we should hypothetically be able to get those. So. Maybe we'll try for those. I don't know how, I think that you, that should be fine. I think we should go for those. I'm just trying to prepare myself because every time I do this, I get excited, it doesn't work. When we do key masters, we like, we stay on this right side. I don't know. Maybe oh my God, just, it is the farthest. Maybe just run it right there on the middle. Like. Or should we run it? I feel like I kind of want to go for that one though because it's, that one will get us quickest. That'll be like the quickest to go for. Paras or the, whatever we get is giveaway and I'd like to give away a pair of Paras even though they're probably my size. What size are they? I think they're 10. I think either one of those options is good. All right, we got our 500 here, all 20s, and uh, we're going for it. And I think we're gonna go for the uh, the Paras. I really like those, I think it'd be a good giveaway shoe. And uh, we're gonna, it's the easiest one to go for. When we go for like the top corner, it's like impossible because it takes so long. We're gonna go for that first. Uh, I think 500 should get it done. I, know, I wanna, we'll, we'll see what happens. So we're gonna load up a couple, probably load up like $100 worth and see where we're at. The shoes themselves are worth what, Nick? Like I don't know, like 250, 200, 250. Yeah. yeah, there we go. 100 bucks. Let's start going and see. Let's see how the machine is to come down low. So there, this one doesn't really have a crazy jump. It's pretty like natural. It has that crazy jump. It's sketchy. I think it stopped because I'm loading up credit. Oh, oh, that looks really close. All right, it's hard to tell. It's hard to tell, but we're gonna we're gonna keep running it. See what we can do. If you compare that to the one at the last mall. The last small was like, it, it had a crazy jump. This is, looks pretty fluid. So it's easier for me to tell on the ones that jump, but we're just gonna have to keep going for it here. It also doesn't give me any time to think about what I'm doing. It's like, I have to immediately go up and let go. So it's honestly a little trickier. It looks like it's right there. On previous machines, that would, like if it's lower, it's a telltale sign, but this, is, this one's pretty accurate. This is like really accurate. So, all right, that's literally already $100. That went really quick actually. Oh, we got one more. 100 went really quick. We get excited about these videos every time we film them. We start playing and spending money, and then I get stressed. Is this accurate, Nick? Definitely. Do you want to go for one? I'll do one. All right, so add another 100, but I'm going to let Nick go right now. I'm going to go around and see what, I mean, if Nick can get it, then he gets a shoe like always, but you ready? It's like right there. Oh, you got to let go like immediately. This is harder to film too. I might do it like yeah, this. Yeah, it's pretty hard to film. I'll do it like this. You can do two more, two more. It's so tough on this one because it's just right there already. This one's tough. Do you think you'll get this one? I don't know. Oh. 
Oh, that was so close on the Oh my bottom. gosh. If that were the other machines that we played, in. it would have went in because that little freaking jump up, but this one doesn't have it. It's very precise. Oh, I, don't, I already got money in there. All right, let's go tripod mode and run it up. I don't want to waste time. So let's do a tripod mode because we'll probably be here for a minute. This credit goes out in 16 seconds. We're gonna go. That's already 200 down. We're almost at the threshold of being able to buy the shoe. That's how this typically goes, but it's going so much quicker because we have that right there. Usually we have to go all the way across. It takes so much longer, but I'm gonna go another 100. Make sure it's the, I'm right. 320 left. I'm gonna put in 120, then I'll leave us with two left. And that'll bring us a total to 320 by the end. Then we're past the threshold of being able to buy them, but that's how this works. That's how this works. So my 20s were not working and maybe the bank gave me fake ones because they were not working, but we got other 20s to make up for. And to be fair, I'm not actually thinking that the bank gave me fake dollars. I think it's probably some of the bills have some stuff on it, some little cuts that it's harder to make them go in. I think we're at 230 right now. That's right at the price of the shoes. See if I can get a better shot from my angle of how this goes in. Look how close. Look how close. Now we're 300 deep. We have exactly 200 left. We could have bought these shoes and had $50 left. And I kind of thought also we could have just gave the 500 to you guys. But Nick, do you want to get in there again? Yeah, I'll run it a couple more. All right, we'll do Nick. Let, do you want to do 40 bucks? Let's go, Nick. Let's go, Nick. I don't know. No way, dude. That's right there. And it's like... How about you got 20 left? I'm gonna let you do the next hundred, like the hundred out. So we'll do it. You can do we'll do a hundred total. See, that's 40. Uh, you can do the hundred total. And again, if he uh, if he gets it, he gets to keep them. But then you you guys might need to bombard him in the comments to let make him give it away. If I get them, I'm gonna give them away to okay. you. How about if he gets them, he you have to follow him in the giveaway too. Maybe that's a good. I'm down with Nick's, that. Nick's like, I'm down for that. And then that'll leave me with a hundred left for me to try to finish it all. Wait. Oh my god, I thought no that was way. it. Say it again? I think it, I think it might be ready because I keep letting off and it's not going up anymore. So I don't know. Come on. Ah, it's like so close. I feel like I'm choking. I need to get this. Is that it? Is that it? Oh. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Wow, Nick actually did it. I can't believe that actually oh, hit. Is that the first time you've ever won? Yeah, I think so. Besides, um, like the one in the three apartment. credits left. Let's go. Pull it out. Pull it out. How much was that? Hey, got what the size? Shoe. What size? Ten. Oh, size ten. It. So are we giving them away, or what are we doing? I think we're gonna give them away. It doesn't Ooh. fit me, so. Oh, we. All right, run your three credits out. All right, all right. And then we'll talk. We got one win. Should I go for the fusion already? Hmm. Or should I go for something crazy just go, to see? Go for the P rod. I'm yeah. gonna go for the P rod. Even though it's like we're not gonna win, just go for it. Imagine, imagine. <laughs> I'm hyped now. If you get two, I'll give you a thousand dollars. Oh, just a little high. One left. Ah, oh, so close. <laughs> Still a just winner. Like right there. Grab them. Let's go. So Nick successfully did it. I think that's 400 total. There was three left, so that was 385-ish. So yeah. I can live with that. So. That's pretty cool. So we still have 100 left that we're gonna run. We're gonna run that again. Odds are, we're probably not gonna win, but hey, win's a win. Who knows? Yeah. I did not think that was gonna happen at I all. I thought there had to be, since the price point, there's probably like, cause what, how do they, what do they have them at? 300, so yeah. 300, we spent 385. It kind of makes sense. Obviously most people aren't coming here and spending 385 on this machine, mm -hmm. but uh, should we do the giveaway details now or wait if we get another pair? Let's do, all right, wait, if we do another one, we'll do two giveaways. The giveaway is gonna be these pars right here, size 10, but Nick's in on it, so. 
You have to one, subscribe to this YouTube channel. Number two, follow Hazelwood Film over on Instagram. And number three, leave a comment on this video with your Instagram username. That's it. You don't have to follow me or anything, but you should follow me. But there we go. Nick, you're about to, you're gonna blow up. Thank you guys for all the support. For real though, on the channel and for me, I love it. Thank you. Yeah, well you guys come up to Nick all the time and say, love the filming. Let's go. So Nick got one, so I got my chance. I have to one up him though. What, what, I gotta go for something. Should I keep going with the P-Rods or what? I, think I can't believe you won. I'm glad you finally won. If you're gonna won. try to get a shoe, I think you need to go for something cheaper because I don't know if that P-Rod will hit unless you want to be here all day. Yeah, we have a hundred bucks. I kind of like the dunk in the middle. It's not too far also. That one. We only have a hundred left, so the odds are pretty low, but I'm glad Nick finally won. How many times? You've played a lot. I'm gonna go for those right there. Five bills left, hundred bucks. We spent 400. We got a shoe though. We're good, we're good. I think, I think it's kind of crazy. I might just have good luck with these because I hit on these for sneakers for my buddy Blake, gave them to him. And for retail. For retail, and I just hit on these in the Keymaster. Like, we we did the Keymaster in the mall. I gotta tell y'all, that I was not expecting that to happen at all. Like, it's so hard to win these. We, do, we play so many times and don't win. It's crazy, but let's go, Para, let's go. All right, so we have three left. Nick's pulling it off. What are the odds we get a buzzer beater last last hit? Never works. We're gonna go for it. As much as one shoe that's worth 280 and spending $500 on it is an L, it's a better L than spending 500 and getting nothing. Final one. This is the final one. The music's loud in the background, so we have to film this one. All right, 495 spent, one shoe. Five left. Should I wait until it's like the last second? Because no, I'm not gonna wait. It's literally like a buzzer beater. Come on. Nope. I mean, I'm not that mad. So now we have to make to claim this prize and kind of show the process of like how it works. So the store owner's on the phone, so we can't really go bother him. But we're gonna go claim Nick's prize and uh. I'll show you guys how he can get his shoe. I'm pretty hyped. Like that was crazy. I, after seeing like how it works, and then when it starts to like hit the bottom and not jump up, you gotta like really, really time it out, and it's gonna hit. And that was crazy. That's with experience, and like obviously, you guys, we've talked about how these machines work. There's a threshold on each shoe, and they put a certain amount of money, and usually it's more than the value of the shoe. Kind of jumps up and doesn't let you win until it reaches that threshold. Looks like we won, Andre. Andre, we got a winner. We spent. How, we, did you hear how much we spent? No, how much? I know you said you started with 500. 500 bucks, so 500. 500 we got it like 385-ish, so. Not too not bad, bad, bad for us, not I'm not bad. mad at it. Okay. So, now how does, this, how does he claim his prize? Uh, I think only got a couple sizes, so. If you want your size or the size that Oh, we can do a different it. size? What do, you, what do you think? I think only got an eight and a half and a 10. Okay, so. I think we'll do the 10 then. Oh, 10? That's okay. cool. There you go. If only it was an 11, then I'd steal it from you guys. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> It all got it ready to go. Is it the bracelet in there too? Yeah, yeah I think the bracelet's oh, in there too. None of the pairs that I have have the bracelet. Bracelet's pretty cool though. Yeah, it's got a flag on it. a Nike emblem. All right, guys, we got the winner here, Nick. He won this time. Secured. Again, these machines, guys, let me take the L's on them. I spent 500, got 285 worth of stuff. That's just how this game works, right? And it's not like, that's just how this is. It's, it's so hard. Like, the amount of luck, like, I don't want to say compared to the lottery, but if you're going to go in there and spend $5 and win, it's so tough to just win right off the road. The odds are, if you're gonna go in there, just like be like, all right, I have $5, and if I lose, I'm I'm not playing anymore, or I have 20 bucks. But you can't sit there and keep playing thinking that it's gonna happen. Like, we do this, we make money off the videos so that we can take these L's for you guys, well, I mean, basically. Think about it, we spent, what, 500 bucks to get a realistically $275, $300 shoe, so. We could have bought it. You could have. We could have just walked in the store five minutes and been right out, but it's still fun to try to like make this content for you guys. Like, I didn't expect to win like that, but it was cool when it hit. I'm glad, Nick. You, you felt the adrenaline, yeah, right? Yeah, I was actually, like, I was genuinely hyped when that hit. I did not think it was gonna happen. Yeah, it's like a different, that's the thing about it. That's how they keep you playing and losing more money. So we're gonna head back now and uh, Nick's gonna not take the shoes. He wants the bracelets in there, but he's- I'm not gonna take the bracelet. He's not gonna take it from I'm you not guys. Gonna, I, I like the bracelet, it's cool, but whoever gets the shoes needs the bracelet with the shoes. All right, guys, we made it back to the warehouse with the sneaker. Do not forget to enter that giveaway. That's a size 10. We also have a size eight and a half that we bought a few weeks back. So if you win the giveaway and you're closer to eight and a half, we'll kind of give you that size. But that's what we got right there. Congrats to Nick for winning that. If you wanna see another Keymaster video, I don't know what we're gonna do because 
I don't know where to go anymore. We'd have to find another key master. We need to find some random one somewhere and try to- But that didn't work out last time. <laughs> it's not good. We won't bring that up, but thank you guys for watching. Hope you're enjoying vlog week. We'll see you guys next time. This is Harrison and Nick, signing out.